we are gonna do an amazing, insane leg workout today. So it's pretty simple in concept, but it's difficult because of the number of sets we're doing. Everything is super easy to remember in terms of reps because everything is 10 repetitions. It's gonna be four movements, three of the four are unilateral, so it means one leg at a time. But at the end of this workout, and then for the one, two, three days following, your quads, glutes, hamstrings, and even calves are gonna be so, so sore. So again, everything is 10 repetitions, it's four total movements, and you're doing between eight and 10 sets, Ugh, not three, not four, eight to 10 sets with as few rest breaks as possible, if any. Okay, so let's get started. Our first move is a step up, and I have just two 10s here, and I also have a 15 pound kettlebell. Actually, I'm gonna put this on the floor. So you can use just the kettlebell, just one weight, whatever you feel is appropriate for you, but I'm gonna bounce back and forth between these two. Cool, so 10 step ups on one leg. And if you look down at my foot, it's staying on the step, it's staying stable. And I'm making this leg do all the work before this one touches down. I think that was five, six, and don't do any swinging with your weights either. You don't want any of momentum like this. Just keep them nice and steady. Whew. Cool. All right, switch your legs. at 10. Next move, I'm going to grab my kettlebell and we're going to do a single leg Bulgarian split squat. So I like to hold the dumbbell where there's space where this leg is back. I also, this is really important you guys, I lay this foot flat. If you have any weird feelings in your shin or your foot, you can also like put your foot like that. I prefer leaving it flat and let me regain my balance here. The other thing that's really, really important is as you go down, make sure you can see your toe over your knee the whole time. If you can't, you have to go out farther. That's really important. You'll almost feel like your stance is too wide. And then when you squat down into it, it'll feel right. So I have that foot in place. I'm gonna put the other one right next to it because I know that that's the perfect distance for me. Get your balance. Off you go. 
seven, eight, nine. Bam. Okay. Last move. I'm gonna hold the kettlebell again. You do ten squats. so excited to see your selfie all sweaty when you're done. Love you guys. Mwah.